Welcome to part 4 in the build series for my CNC router. In this video will I be assembling all the parts that I made in part 3. So when the assembly is over, the only thing I have to do is add all the electronics and then the router should be done. I was surprised to see how well most of the parts fit together. All the holes were drilled about 0.6mm larger than the matching bolt. And therefore I was pretty surprised to see that everything fits so nicely. I start off by assembling the gantry. That's because I need the gantry's rails in order to make everything else straight. It took quite a bit of tweaking to mount this plate in a way that it wouldn't be binding on the rails. The continuity in the following clips isn't very good, but that's because I had to disassemble and assemble and disassemble a few parts. Every time I tightened a bolt, I made sure that all the bearings ran smoothly afterwards. Now it's time to assemble the base. The base consists of these aluminum extrusions that I'll be mounting a table on top of. I sadly didn't get any footage of me mounting the gantry onto the base. But this is what the finished assembly looks like. I would say everything turned out really well. The gantry is rock solid and there's no play anywhere. I have to say I'm pretty impressed with myself. Because almost everything went together just as I have planned. A few parts didn't fit perfectly together. But that was only due to my newbie machining skills. In the next episode will I be adding all the motors and the electronics. So soon this machine will be running. If you like this video then please leave a like and consider subscribing. It really helps me. Thank you very much for watching.